Hi, I'm Dr. Nick Nineman with Nineman Chiropractic Clinic, and thanks for tuning in for today's video blog. I apologize for uh, not putting very many of these out towards the end of 2014. Uh, things just got kind of busy here at the office, end of the year stuff. And uh, but now with 2015 here, uh, we're gonna pick it back up with the video blogs. Uh, should be putting one out uh, one each week. Uh, get back on track with that. So I hope everyone had a good holiday. Um, what I want to talk about today. I get a lot of mothers uh, as patients here in the clinic uh, complaining of back pain, and they, you know their complaint is that they, you know for, you know they're picking up their kids, they're holding their babies, and and they just seem to you know they can't get rid of this back pain. This is something I see all the time. Uh, and the same could go for fathers as well with holding and picking up their kids. I do see that too, uh, but it seems to be really common with the mothers uh, um, that are you know some are stay-at-home moms, but. Uh, so they're constantly picking up kids all day. Um, I've also had uh, patients who, you know, they work in a daycare setting, so they're again lift, they're holding kids all day, picking up kids. So, um, so that it, you know, it produces a lot of back pain. Um, and the the question I always get is they ask me, you know, is there a proper way that I can uh, hold a hold a child, or you know, what's what's the best way to hold a child so that it doesn't hurt my back? And uh, I hate to say this, but there really is no good way to hold a, hold a child or, or an infant, a uh, newborn. Um, there just really isn't, uh, posturally, uh, there's just not a really good good way to do it. So, you know, if you're holding a baby like this, uh, you know, I mean, it's, it's putting weight forward, uh, can cause you to round your shoulders, uh, the head goes down and forward, again, that causes a lot of neck and, and upper back issues. Um, you know, holding, holding the child off to the right side with all with this added weight to the right side, you're typically going to compensate by leaning to the left. You know, same thing with holding holding the child over here. You're going to lean to the right to compensate. It's just putting abnormal uh, uh, curvature into the spine. Uh, creates a lot of discomfort in the spine, the rib cage, the muscles. Uh, just creates a whole lot of problems. You know, then you have the carriers, which those do help take a little bit of pressure off. Uh, you know, but if you have the, the carrier where you're holding the baby in the front, again, that puts extra weight out front. Typically, you compensate by leaning back, which can cause back issues. Same thing if you have a carrier on, the, on your back. Uh, you typically lean forward, just like, like a kid with a heavy backpack. You lean forward. The shoulders roll forward. Again, that causes back issues. So there really is no good way uh, to hold a child or an infant or a newborn baby. So um, the, the best piece of advice I can give you is to try... Uh, you know, the most common way is, you know, holding the child off on one side. Uh, the best piece of advice I can give you is just to alternate sides. Uh, you know, don't get fixated always holding the child on one side because uh, that can st start creating a chronic postural uh, issue. Um, you know, as far as picking up a child, obviously, that's, that's just basic, you know, lifting principles. You know, always bend at the knees, uh, you know, take your butt down, down towards the ground, you know, pick the child up and lift with your, with your knees and your butt. Uh, your legs and your butt, you know, don't bend forward and over or twist because uh, that's also a great way to hurt your back. So, you know, that's pretty standard, just lifting principles. But, um, you know, and then just, I guess, to top off what I just said, I mean, for these uh, pe mothers or fathers that are, are having these issues, uh, I know with, with our newborn son, uh, when Winnie was a newborn, uh, I used to always carry him and I was getting a lot of uh, thoracic pain, you know, in between the shoulder blades uh, with holding him. So I know how it goes. So, but the best thing I can say is it, uh, if you are dealing with some of these things, you should get checked out by a chiropractor. You know, give us a call, come in. Um, I mean, really everyone should be seeing a chiropractor, but specifically if, if you have young children and you're holding them and lifting them, you really should see a chiropractor because when I do see these patients that, that are taking care of kids, uh, I mean, they usually have some significant uh, spinal dysfunction and they need adjusted. So definitely give us a call and we can help you out. So thanks for tuning in today. Uh, hope you have a great weekend and uh, we're going to be right back here next week and get, get, get going again with regular video vlogs. Have a good one.